Yo guys, what is going on? Welcome back to a brand new WWE Supercard video, episode number 80. In the last episode, we proed Randy Orton, and just to clear up a bit of confusion, I titled the video Randy Orton Pro Fail, because for me it was a fail that I'd leveled him up and didn't sandbag him King of the Ring. I associated the Randy Orton being pro and the fail as kind of two separate things, and people obviously assumed that I meant I failed in proing the Randy Orton, but I failed in the in in the whole of like it was it, like in the whole of it it was a fail because I meant to I meant to sandbag him and not level him up. So overall, sorry about that again for the confusion. You know, couple couple of the last couple of videos or two of my last like five or six videos now have been um. Yeah, a little bit, a little bit like, um, what's the word? You know, people like saying I clickbaited, but I changed the title again. Look, I prefer put the title to whatever, guys, whatever makes you happy, guys, than to have people arguing or people saying I clickbait. So, yeah, change the title of the video again, and that's all good. But, yeah, I didn't really mean it in that way. I meant it in the way that I failed about samming the Randy Orton. But, anyway, guys, we are a couple shards are off of getting our Jack Gallagher. Um, two, four, six, eight, we're nine shards away. So let's get into some gameplay, and I will sh there will, there's going to be a little bit of a treat at the end of this video. Well, a little bit of a treat for you guys, and I suppose, actually, you know what? No, I will, I'll probably do that in the next video, just, just so we, just, just so we have always some, some fun and entertaining stuff to do in all the videos, because tomorrow's video, there won't probably be anything as Ringdon will be finished, waiting for the team event, so... I will I will show uh, instead of doing it in this video I'll do it in tomorrow's video. Um apart from that, power, proc, 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 Neville. Damn it. But anyway, yeah, we'll play a couple games of Ring Dom. We should be able to get the Jack Gallagher card pretty easily uh in the next 10-15 minutes. So yeah, enjoy. Hope you guys enjoy this video. If you do, smash a like, do subscribe, thank you as well, guys, again for the great support we've been getting. Um, 2,600 we hit, um, which is great, so thank you a lot for that. I haven't streamed, uh, didn't stream yesterday, I haven't streamed today. We'll probably do like a bit of a FIFA stream actually maybe again today. That was really fun to do the other day and uh, definitely want to do more of that. And we'll go ahead and do that on Twitch. There's not much for me to do on Supercard as I'm about to finish this Jack Gallagher card. Anyway, we get the win there, 5-4, we got 8 picks on the board to do. Which is going to be very nice. So let's see if we can get a pick ourselves at least two shards would be great. Uh, just man, that's the first shard. Being like the last two games have been really lucky for me shard wise. Um, I got like three or four shards in a row just before starting this video. So that was uh, that helped me out quite a bit. So we've already got one shard. We've got five picks left. Well, four picks now with five choices left. So we should be able to get ourselves another shard off this board. Let's go with these, there we go, got the shard and we'll go with that one. And it is, so three shards uh, in total for there, so we've only got six more left to do. Um, so two more games of ring domination and that should be it. So let's get back into it. So now, yeah, I haven't, I haven't properly seen the whole picture, I will, I will give you guys my final verdict on what I think about the picture once we actually get the card. Uh, but so far, like, it's it's a decent picture, it could have been so much better, I think, just if they would have added the umbrella in the picture, that would have been fantastic, I think. I really would have liked them to add um, the umbrella, but you can't have everything, just the fact that we're getting a Jack Gallagher card is pretty awesome indeed. Fastlane is on the 4th of March, I think, some somewhere around that, 3rd or 4th of March, I'm pretty sure it's the 4th. So, predictions video will be out on the Wednesday before. I always like doing, you know, all the events on Sundays. I put my uh, my predictions video out on the Wednesdays. Um, for the last two predictions videos I've done, they've announced um, more matches after I've uploaded the video. But their matches that really aren't important, like Mojo Rolly versus um, Kurt Hawkins was one of them on, on the last pay-per-view. And on the pay-per-view before that, it was like a... Uh, um, that the women's tag match on, on the kickoff show, so not very important matches. So as long as I cover that the important matches, I think that's all that matters. We'll be doing live streams for all the pay-per-views in future, so if you guys did enjoy the fact that I did that for Elimination Chamber last time, then let me know down below in the comments. Alright guys, sorry for that interruption. Um, I, what I was doing is I was picking on the board and we were talking about the predictions, so yeah, let me know in the comments down below if you guys did enjoy 
um, when I did it for the Elimination Chamber. I'll be doing it again. Now, the one that I did for the Elimination Chamber, obviously, I titled it again, Controversial, um, live, I don't even know what I called it. Uh, let me go back and have a look what I called it. Yeah, Elimination Chamber live reactions. I think that is definitely not clickbait, as I am watching the Elimination Chamber. It is live, and I am reacting to it. And if anybody says that's clickbait, then, may I... I won't know, I don't know what to do, but obviously lots of people who clicked on the video thought that, that I was showing it on the screen, which obviously I can't do for copyright reasons, but we'll, do, we'll definitely be doing that in the future, especially if you guys want me to, but I think even if not everybody wants me to, I think I'll still be doing it. Anyway, we're about to get his face, which is going to be an important, an important trial to see whether I really like this card or not, so let's go and get it. Okay, okay, I st I'll still give you guys my final verdict at the end. We've got four shards left, which means we're only going to have to play one more game of Ring Domination, and then we are done. Um, we have to win it, actually, because if we, if, we, if we lose it, we'll, we'll, we'll probably have to play another game, unless we get very lucky. So, let's go and do my best. Randy Orton up there. Uh, perfect. Mr. Neville himself there. Stone Cold there. You there. And you there. Well, oh, brilliant. Brilliant. When you can play games like that, quick, quick, quick. Lovely. No event cards, though. That, that was quite shocking. Or maybe one event or two. No, no, no. There was a, a no event cards from him, I mean. Um, Alright, so there we go. Let's go and get ourselves this Jack Gallagher card. Pretty awesome, guys. I'm actually really excited. Can't wait to get the pro. I'll actually try for once to get RTG like done as soon as possible because... I always put it off and put it off and put it off. I've even done it with Ring Domination at this point. So we're going to try do my best to get it as quick as possible. So anyway, his um, his finish is the running uh, corner drop kick. He procs in toughness and charisma, which I think is perfect. Um, and now let's talk a little bit about this picture. Okay, there we go. We've officially got the Jack Gallagher card. Pretty awesome. So now let me think. Let me tell you guys what I think about it. Um, overall, when I look at the card... Now, I'm, this is, I'm not saying this like in a, in a, in a weird, a horrible way, I mean, you know, the C, look at me, you know, but I'm not too sure what these little marks are, like right there, it looks really weird, and that's like kind of the thing that just, like, my eye, like, it just, it looks like very, I don't know, it, my eyes just go straight to that for some reason, it looks really weird, like just here, like, I don't know, that just looks weird, but, um, Overall, I think the picture's okay, to be fair. I mean, it's his debut card, first ever card in the game. I hope it's not his last, but overall, the picture's really cool. But imagine if he was holding an umbrella, how, how much better that would be. So, if you guys didn't know, Jack Gallagher is the best card in the game, or his event card will be the best card in the game. So, let's go ahead and lock him really quickly before we forget and accidentally train him away or something. There he is. Mr. Jack Gallagher himself, which is really cool. So there we go. There we go. There we go. Um, I will pr like his stats are quite well rounded as well. To be fair, um, he is he is quite a fast guy. He's you know he's not the most powerful guy. I completely agree with the stats. I think he could have been a, sp a speed and charisma guy. I think toughness and charisma though is 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 fine as well. Um, so overall, he's a left arrow as well, which is going to be great because he will tag with he will tag with Randy Orton, he will tag with Bret Hart, and he will tag with Mankind. So, I mean, we've had three event pros that are right arrows, which is quite a lot. I'd still I'd, the next event card. I really want it to be an up arrow, but it probably won't. It'll probably be like a down arrow or something. But yeah, overall, that's what's been going on. Um, I haven't really been working on Bailey at all, trying to get her the games played. Um, that's one of the cards. This is the other one. I will put her in Team RTG. That will be the next event. I've also got this Braun Strowman that's still yet to pro from the um, unlimited uh, pull glitch, for the ring, the like weeks ago, two weeks, three, almost three weeks ago. So I'll get, I'll put him in, I'll get him pro just like I did instantly quick with the Bray Wyatt, get him pro and then we'll have, like, we already do, I think, have a full RTG deck. Yeah, we do, we do. Um, but Braun Strowman will kick, uh, kick out like that Brian Kendrick, and then honestly it's going to be a really, really solid um, 
RTG deck. You know, once I get a Bailey pro we'll say goodbye to Naomi, and then it'll be a full Ultimate Pro deck. Not bad at all, right? Not bad. So, King of the Ring, how's how's my King of the Ring been doing? Um, Big Tuna. Uh, I, I, does anyone know where that reference comes from, guys? Oh, mate, I need to say something in the chat. Big Tuna. Nice name, mate. Um, it comes from The Office, if you guys haven't watched it. It might not, actually. It might be a complete coincidence, but I'm pretty sure it's... I mean, he's probably a bot, so never mind. Or is he? Maybe not. Mm, yeah, no, he's definitely a bot. Never mind. Pfft, that was so stupid. No, I was such an idiot. I don't know why. But anyway, um... The ref light, I mean, big, I thought Big 2. If someone was actually called Big 2, they must have watched The Office, I mean. But anyway... Um, we're looking, we're looking for the second place, if not semi-finals, just to catalog, you know, catalog all that good stuff. So we're aiming, we're aiming for second place. Um, but yeah, my, like I'm not doing amazingly. Um, why? I, I'm not too sure, really. Is it just because I forgot to energize? Really, I think so. I think I shouldn't have too much of a problem um, winning this, not winning this King of the Ring, but getting very far at least in this King of the Ring. So. I think we'll be okay. I, I honestly think we'll be okay. Um, if we go on standings, who's the top seed? At Pew. At Pew is number one. I've, I've obviously played against him. There, there he is. So, he... Okay. 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 And okay. I could beat him, just as he could beat me, really. So, yeah, he's been doing good. But yeah, 13 and 9, I don't really need to be doing better. Just casually uh, qualify and then see what we can do in the contender brackets. So guys, what I'll be doing in the next video, I'll give you guys a sneak peek already so you guys can look forward to it tomorrow. I'll be going to, I'll be speeding up this fusion. Um, I could do it right now, but to be fair, I, well, I might as well just do it tomorrow. Uh, I'll just save some credits, which would be great. The credits I save from it, I'm, I'll just use them in RTG, which it's like playing RTG for free, kind of, not really. Um, so that's what we'll be doing. Um, what else do I have to say? Yeah, the um, my most viewed videos you guys know is the, obviously the um, the video I did about the glitch and the ring domination a couple weeks ago. That is on twenty eight thousand three hundred views. So we're getting close to that thirty k. That's going to be a huge thing to hit thirty thousand views on a video. Absolutely massive. And then, um, yeah, that's going to be really cool. So thank you for all of that. We're also not too far from 200,000 total views on the channel. That is really awesome as well. And overall, thank you for the support. Again, I'm sorry, guys, for the confusion and just for the controversy over people saying, saying well, that was a really bad list, saying that I'm clickbaiting. As I, I titled it, and your pro fail. Because as in my eyes, it was the overall, it was a massive fail. I mean, for weeks... I, in every video, I was like, I'm going to sandbag him in King of the Ring. I was even waiting to level up my Bray Wyatt and Chris Jericho for the King of the Ring. And I messed it up. So that's what I meant by the fail. It wasn't really. I didn't mean for it to be clickbait or, or to be construed as clickbait. But anyway, thank you guys so much for watching this video. If you have enjoyed, do leave a like for Jack Gallagher. Um, now the, yeah, now we're going to do this really quickly before we do end out the video. Um, Jack Gallagher with a J, so he should be right there. And I'm going to say him as my champion. Absolutely perfect. Thank you guys so much for watching this video. I'll see you in the next one. Till then, peace out. And most importantly, take care. Bye.